Hello guys, it's me, the Larson Fan A42. We are here for the 2018 version of my diecast haul from Michigan. If you saw part one, hope you did. Go check that out right now. Leave this video. I have 14 cars that you missed out when I looked at them. I make a made a big announcement, I think. So I have I think like 15 2018s. Let's get in them from about my leastest favorite I got to my favorite. Some of them were must-haves. I'm, I'm looking. First car is the Atomic Banana Paul Menard. I already had the Blaney in my third diecast review. So here it is, the Atomic Banana. This will be reviewed, all 2018 cars reviewed. Now I feel like there could be a problem on the 21. Oh yeah, there looks like there could be an... This car is a little screwy. Yeah, you'll hear more about that in the video. But you can see how this 21 right above the line. Only I can see that. Yep, they messed that up. That's fine. Next car. It's a pretty nice car. Austin Dillon's AAA Camaro. Most of the cars I got were Camaros for the 2018s. It's a nice car. I think this is my second, this will be my second awesome Dylan Camaro, third Dylan Camaro in all. I haven't got to a tie Dylan Camaro yet, by the way, just saying. So, that's nice. Move these 2017s back. Next is a car that they messed up on, I hear. Chase Light Sun Energy 1. I hear this is messed up. Looks like it. Don't care for it too much. Unlike, um, I think it was the ACS Racing Network. Shout out to him. He won't care though. He never watches my videos. But, um, but um, yeah, it's a little messed up, but that's fine. Next is a must-have, in my opinion. I dropped it. Truex is Tracker Boats. Best Pro. Sex that they can't put fire or energy on it. That's why I don't like it as much. I'd be loving it more if they had the fire or energy on it. Next. This is a nice car. Alex Bowman's Exalta 88 with the red and yellow and black. Very beautiful Camaro right here. I'm noticing that this diecast haul is not taking as long as my first one. So, ugh. Well, I, mean, I can get another look at that. Here we go. Next is a car that they changed up a lot from the past few years. The few years it was just black and with some white, but now it's white with some black. It's coming over to Jimmy Jones. I kind of like the change, changing up a bit. And you see how this change is doing. Definitely a great car, but it's on that platform probably. Where's the, there's the bush, right there. It's on a platform because of that. Up next, I got this the day he won. I don't believe it. Clint Boyer's Haas. Now, why is this such a special car? Oh, yeah. When I got it, it was pouring, so I had no choice. It's bent because it was dry, it was wet. Got it, got it ripped up a little bit, but that's fine. So, story of this car. This is the only car that I got that you cannot order online yet. It was only at the haulers at Michigan, so if you're saying, oh, I should go order this online, it's not out. You're not going to find it unless someone bought it from Michigan and um, sold it immediately. But um, yeah, I love that car. It's a must-have for you Boyer fans out there. Next up, oh, I won't do that one yet. Next up. Ty Dillon's Twisted T. Now, I'm surprised this one came out early and his Geico didn't. Because usually every year his Geico always comes out first. But a nice car. This is going to be on a platform, of course. But, um, yeah. That's fine. It's a very nice car with the blue and yellow. Oh. Oh, that's not good. Next up, Chase Elliott. His Kelly Blue Book, probably one of the best Chase Elliott's this year. Uh, where is it? Oh, uh, his Napa number nine is nice. And this, 
only a sparkle is on the white, which is sucky. It really is bad. But, um, I like the car. The gold and blue is going to be really good. So, hopefully, this is this is a very nice car when I unbox it. Oh, sorry, I'm back. So, I made a big mistake. So, I was at a shop where I basically bought, most certainly, all of these. So, like I was saying, I got that Liberty University Newman car. Very nice. Love the green and blue. But then I did something stupid. I accidentally got two! So, there's two options I could do here. I won't reach 500 subs for a while. I said I would do that giveaway. So, I could either save this for the giveaway or sell it on eBay. Ask me in the comments what I should do. Or should I just keep it? I don't know. But well, I'll review one of these. I'm not going to open both. So, yeah. How funny is that? Almost done here. Next. It's a very nice car. Probably the best box overall. It's Jeff Gordon slash William Byron's 24 ever car. And the first ever Jeff Gordon Camaro, technically. It has, it's basically a Gordon car. It has Gordon's final ride there and then Gordon's exalted car. But Byron's exalted car, I guess. This is going to be fun to unbox. Whoops. Ah. Wow, that was not good. Next is my second favorite one in 64 I got. Next will be the first one, but Newman's Bass Pro Cabela's. It was love at first sight when I saw this car. I mean, the Cabela's Bass Pro. What You can't go wrong with a Bass Pro Shop Cabela's car. For some reason, I love it way more than Truex Bass Pros or the Stewart Bass Pros. It might just be the dark green. I don't know, but I love this car. This might be hard to review because of the green color. Don't worry, guys. Now, before... Now I'm going to show you this. This is my favorite car I got. Bubba's Click and Close 43. My favorite car I got. Purple. It's dark now, but it'll probably be light when I unbox it. I cannot wait to open this beauty. This is an amazing car. That is beautiful. Now, when I got there, I got there around Saturday morning. Saturday, not Saturday around noon. So, um, we, my dad got something on Facebook, I guess, that Bubble Wallace was going to be in a Myers. That was like four mi miles from our hotel. Myers, miles, my, say that five times fast. Myers, miles, my, Myers, miles, my, blah, 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 blah. but, um, he was going to be at, Bubble was going to be at a Myers. So, from three to four, we thought it'd be a huge line. It wasn't actually huge. Blah, it was on only Facebooks, I guess, so. So. We got there, and I did some, I, I planned it out at a shop, so I met Bubba. I got a selfie with him. I might show you that, because I might show you my face. But um, there's this, I got his autograph. And then this was pretty awesome. Right before we left the campgrounds, right before we left the campgrounds, I got another Bubba car. And he, guess what he did? He signed it. So I have Bubba's signature. I'm never going to open this, by the way. If you think that this is going to be unboxed, you are funny. You're just the funniest guy ever. Because this will never be unboxed in my life. I love Bubba. And then you got that. And because of that experience, my mom's favorite driver is now Bubba Wallace. So that's cool. This will never be unboxed. But there, let me go put this back. And then something much greater happened. This will be the last thing. I will I will talk about I think I told you I got 29 one and 64s and that's one and 24. Now you guys know who my favorite driver is. You will not believe what I got and what happened to this. Kyle Larson's 2018 one and 24 credit one bank Camaro. Look at that. I'm not going to review this, probably. This is just for show. This is probably the best thing I got all weekend. My mom got it at... She got it in, um... At the track on Sunday for me. Now, let me show you something. 
comes with all this garage line out stuff. So you open it up and you get this awesomeness. Look at that. Got the Camaro. I can lift it up. So let's look at the car. I can never put that. The axle. I'm looking at it right now. I'm sorry, but now something different is that this does not open on the Camaros. Now the hood, I think, opens, but um, just a beauty. Now you look at that. I met Larson, and he signed it. He signed it. There's a Monster Energy symbol. <coughs> Excuse me. This was this is awesome. This probably made my weekend. Look at that. I'll probably end it there. I'm so glad I got this, guys. So I hope you enjoyed my video. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't. Probably should say that. But um, the road to 300. That's a very awesome car. Thank you, parents. The Camaro looks beautiful. My first 2018 one in 24 so far. So, this will end the video, guys. This is the Larson Fan 842 signing off. Hope you enjoyed my Michigan haul. Don't forget to watch part one, even if you watch this first.